Claudia, and uh, perhaps you recognize me if you've been following along with our journey here at The Pink Inc. I am one of the team members. I work alongside the founder of The Pink Inc., uh, Shay, and uh, help her with the daily digital marketing tasks as well as customer support. But today I am going to be introducing you to one of our new ideas that has been brewing in our minds for some time now. We're really excited to share that I will be documenting a journey of mine in creating a digital planner for my own business, Ciao Bella Media. So I work as a freelancer under the business Ciao Bella Media. We thought that this would be an amazing opportunity to show you how I utilize the tools within the Digital Planner Academy and the Digital Planner Design Mastery courses to create something for my own business and to help grow my own business. Let me give you a glimpse of where I'm at. So over the past five years, I've been immersed in the world of digital marketing, like full on. And I've been working online and remotely for this period. I live in Italy so that it's really been a godsend for me, a lifesaver that I've been able to work remotely and live in Italy while still working with international clients. However, at the moment, I find myself in a bit of a transitional phase where I feel I need to shake things up. I've been reflecting on what truly matters to me in terms of my work. It, really boils down to creativity. So perhaps some of you who are watching this that know me personally have always known that I've been immersed in the world of creative arts and photography. And I feel that has been lacking in my life. I have come to the realization that I am really missing a part of me, which is my creative side. I was very involved in the world of photography and film production. I worked for film production companies in South Africa, in Cape Town, and my main focus was fine art photography. I had some exhibitions and my main body of work was always around the world of ecology, which is how humans connect with the natural world. But that's another story. What I'm trying to get at is creativity was a huge part of my life and I realized that it's so important for your well-being to constantly nurture and cultivate that creative side of you. This is where I started chatting with Shay and she loved the idea that I could utilize the knowledge that I've, I've gained working with Shay for three years in her business and helping entrepreneurs build digital products and create online stores selling digital stationery products and like gel the two together. When creativity is suppressed, it's a great loss. This is what I want to do. I want to help entrepreneurs because we are a little bit creative and ditzy and just like harness that magic. Let me tell you a little bit more. In this creative series, I will share my journey with you. The purpose is twofold. I want to ignite my own creativity and I also want to foster this focus on creative projects and I want to help other individuals do the same. Every week I'll be, we'll be dropping a new video on YouTube showing you behind the scenes of how we go about in the ideation phase, mapping out who I'm creating this planner for. We'll get into the creative side of designing it and considering the color palette, etc. And then eventually actually the techie side of setting up this digital planner in my favorite software, which is Affinity Publisher. And yeah, so stick around. Be sure to join us as I capture my thoughts, share every single aspect of this journey with you. Thanks so much and I'm really excited. 